UNCG professor Mark Schultz says he remembers riding his bicycle down Acock Street near Walker last Wednesday night, heading home on his usual two-mile bike commute. But that's when his memory fails him. The next thing I remember is being, you know, jostled around inside the uh, EMT van. Schultz, a Ph.D. who teaches epidemiology at UNCG, suffered a concussion, a broken sternum, five broken ribs, five compressed vertebrae, and a broken kneecap. But it wasn't until he read the police report that he got angry. She, she said she looked up from text messaging and, you know, saw my bike, and, but it was too late, and uh, tried to swerve out of the way and missed and... Or, you know, wasn't able to swerve in time and hit me. Already a bicycle activist, Schultz says he now wants to change North Carolina's law, making it illegal to talk or text on a cell phone while driving, and plans to talk to his own state legislator, Pricey Harrison. Because I've had some pretty close calls myself when I've been on the roads here in Greensboro. Harrison herself is an active bicyclist. You know, we've had legislation for the past several sessions that would ban cell phone use, both texting and talking, while driving, and it just, it just has an attraction. But she says Schultz's story gives her renewed hope to try again. At least limited to hands-free use. Um, and, um, you know, while driving. In Greensboro, Karen Myers, Fox 8 News. Yeah, and this is a week out. I haven't looked.